We think that, it's, that AI has matured beyond the point where you just need to understand how artificial intelligence works. One real-life conservation problem uh, is um, wind farms, lots of wind turbines being set up, and birds, particularly large birds, sometimes fly into the wind turbines and get killed. What has been found is that you can use artificial intelligence attached to video cameras to spot incoming eagle, uh, identify it, find out what direction it's traveling in, and switch off a set of wind turbines that allow the eagle to go past safely, and then switch the wind turbines back on after the eagle has gone past. So you wouldn't necessarily associate artificial intelligence with resolving a conservation issue like that, but yet it can be used if we think creatively about the way these things work. There's a lot of talk about how robots, how automated systems will take over many jobs. What we're trying to do here is equip students with the skills that they need for this new world. We want our graduates to be there, able to operate in, in that world, rather than thinking about the past world.